After two days of grueling competition that pitted seven nationally ranked teams in the 2016 ACC Women's Lacrosse Tournament, the title game came down to a battle of two top five teams in the country, North Carolina and Syracuse. A soggy sunrise gave way to clear skies, setting up a showdown in legendary Lane Stadium, home of Virginia Tech football. The ACC championship once again looked to be a clash of titans, just as it did a year ago when the Orange upset the Tar Heels in double overtime for the title. Syracuse started off hot as Riley Donahue worked her way to the middle and ripped a shot past the keeper to put the Orange up 2-1. to one. The Cues quickly extended their lead to 5-2 to two as Kayla Trainer crossed the ball to Holly Majorana, who found the back of the net. UNC went on a run of their own, scoring five of the next six goals, three of which came within one minute of each other. This momentum shift gave the Tar Heels a 7-6 lead. Syracuse's Gabby Jaquith would score while falling down to tie the game up going into the half. The second half mirrored the first. Syracuse came out hot, going on a 4-1 run to take an 11-8 lead. After swapping five goals between the two teams, Syracuse maintained a 13-11 lead with just over four minutes left in regulation. North Carolina captains Kelly Devlin and Sammy Joe Tracy provided an answer for the Heels as they rallied back to tie the score at 13-all. With just over 30 seconds to go, the Tar Heels' leading scorer on the year, Molly Hendrick, scored what looked to be the game-winning goal. However, with six seconds left, Syracuse looked for a miracle and found one as Kelly Cross put the ball in the back of the net, forcing overtime. With momentum on Syracuse's side and UNC two players down, the odds were against the Tar Heels. Senior Allie Messenger was not going to be denied the title a second year. She bounced the ball off the ground and passed the orange goalkeeper to win the game and the ACC championship for North Carolina. It meant a lot. I mean, we had some unfinished business to take care of from last year, and um, it's just an amazing feeling to, you know, take the trophy from someone who beat us last year. So it's really exciting, and especially in an overtime when we were two, man down, two men down, it's just a great feeling. Before overtime, we were all saying, like, we believe, like, we are going to win this game, so no matter what, we're winning. And, yeah, there was a bunch of emotions going on, but, I mean, we were able to pull it off, which is amazing. The ACC is the hardest hardest uh, conference championship to win. It's uh, three games over four days, uh, great competition, really good coaches, kids, everything, and everybody wants to win it. Most teams are coming in very highly ranked. We've all competed hard during regular season. So it's the moment, it's a championship weekend, and uh, to be able to capture it is, is very special. With the win, North Carolina took home the ACC Women's Lacrosse Championship for just the second time and first since 2002.